Hey guys, it's Fatma. Hope you're all well. What's goody? Wrong hoodie. Anyways, today I'm coming at you guys with a vlog. I haven't done that in absolutely ages. Today I am going to be thrift shopping for the first time in my life. I am 23 years old and have never been thrift shopping. So this is going to be a very new experience, hopefully a enjoyable experience that makes me want to thrift again. Heavy on the attempting because obviously this is my first time I might not get some good bits and pieces. There is this one pop-up shop that I've seen all over TikTok and I'm heading there right now. I'm also going to go hijab shopping because I haven't been in ages. Yeah, so come with me. Oh, my hand hurts. This is out of touch. This is out of my element. Why am I holding the camera like this? You got games on the phone. Come with me. Let's jump into Kiki. Welcome to London, the city of traffic. I've been sat in the same position for like two minutes now and it's raining. Welcome to London. I have finally arrived, but I have never been to the Stratford West. I have never been to the Westfield Stratford ever in my life. I've never driven here, and boy oh boy, I hate this car park. I went through three different levels. I am on the third floor. It's 10 past 12 right now. I feel like I'm gonna be waiting in a queue. Anyway, we'll see. I said the first floor. I don't know. Mercy, what is going on? Supposedly they're on the first floor, so let's try and check them out. Oh goodness gracious me. Good check. I've only been here an hour and a half, max hour and a half, and I just got charged eight quid. The rules don't apply, not in East London. You lot are thieves. That lift was taking me for one mug. Why am I waiting one trillion years for one lift to go down one floor? I had to go down the stairs. It was very scary. Uh, very very scary scenes the thrift shop wasn't giving what it was supposed to give maybe because i was a newbie and i didn't know what i was doing but it was very very much miss it gave me the vibe of um 70s disco like stuck in the 70s type of clothes it wasn't giving what i was expecting but it doesn't mean i'm gonna stop i'm gonna go to another thrift shop that's very local to my house instead of trucking all the way to flipping east london east london gives me the heebie-jeebies and the fact that i drove all the way here for the first time in my life I'm very proud of myself. I did, however, drop by oh, full time. So I did stop by Kiko and got myself two lip glosses. One is a clear, and then this is um, my favorite shade 21. I absolutely love it. Paired off with their lip liner 321 Chef Kiss, my lip combo. Also got myself some wide leg trousers from Pull and Bear. Pull and Bear is really the it girl. Also stopped by my favourite place ever, Bobbleology. 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 Bobble tea. I haven't gotten a milk tea from this place. I always get fruit teas, which is the mango fruit tea with light tea popping balls. That's all I ever get. But today I decided to go different look. I treated myself. I thought, you know what? You didn't get so lucky at the thrift shop. Get yourself some bubble tea. This is not all for me, by the way. Oh my goodness gracious. You know, being a sibling, if you get something for yourself, you gotta get it for your siblings too. This is the um, plain Asim, Asim milk tea. They didn't have the caramel frap that I wanted. But you know, it will, it will do. I got it regular because you know, I wasn't about to splash out on a large. Imagine I don't like it. Waste of peas, waste of money. Free up the turtles, save up the turtles. Bismillah, one, two, three. I'm really, I'm always scared to do this. No phone, go over there. People do this, does that help? Woo! There, Bismillah. Um. It's not bad at all, actually. People say that if you want milk tea or real authentic bubble tea, you gotta go to um, the spots in Chinatown and in central London in that area. Bubble tea apparently is a colonizer. <laughs> Just came and said, you know what? I can do what you're doing better. This is my first time having it, it's all right. I got a taste the ones in central London to actually compare the two, but this is all right. I usually get the mango fruit tea, so it's kind of just like whatever. I've been mumbling for six minutes, my goodness. 
I just saw a man staring at me. You gotta clutch a purse now, guys. Boys and girls, lock your flipping doors. People are weird out here. I know that I'm not gonna be able to vlog at Whitechapel because there are pickpockets, there are thieves. The rules don't apply in East London. I'm not even gonna park near Whitechapel where I'm off to. I'm parking somewhere else because I heard they be stealing tires. Tires! Who in this day and age steals tires? My skirt isn't screwed on right. I'm gonna grab some hijabs, maybe some jerseys, maybe chiffons because someone commented on my YouTube channel that um, all I ever wear is hoodies and black hijabs. You're not wrong, but why are you calling me out? Why? It was at this moment I was regretting my decisions. I didn't realize I parked 15 minutes away. My legs were screaming for help. Kiki the Kier, I miss you. I'm over it, mate. Many hours later. I got eight hijabs. That's right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> eight hijabs, all in here, for 20 quid. And I also got some underscarfs. There's the other one somewhere here. I don't know where it is. I got some underscarfs and some safety pins because, you know, Got to be pinned up so I have your hijab slipping or sliding for nobody. That brings us to the end of this video. I was going to try to take it further, but walking to Whitechapel, it was way too much. If you would like more of these types of videos, give this video a thumbs up. Let me know down below what would you like to see on this channel of mine. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. Thank you guys so much for watching and I shall see you all in my next video. Bye!